Okay, dear students, let us see what is there in this question. In an experiment to determine the speed of the sound in air, okay, so we want to find V. A tube that is open at the top is filled with water and a vibrating tuning fork is held over the tube as the water is released through a wall. Okay, so this valve, like the water is getting out of this valve here, so the level is falling. An increase in intensity of the sound is heard for the first time when the air column length is x. So if it is the first time, this should be the first harmonic. The next increase is heard when the air column length is y. So this becomes the next harmonic. So what is the next harmonic when we are considering like one end closed and one end open? It is third harmonic. It's not the second harmonic, my dear students, please be careful here. First harmonic and the even harmonics are not present there in this case when one end is open and one end is closed. So when the water is released to the wall and this becomes Y, the next increase is heard at Y. Okay, so what are the other questions? And let us uh, read this thing. Which expression are approximately correct for the wavelength of the sound? So we want to find the wavelength of the sound. Fine, let us see. Okay, we keep it like this only. So, which expression is the correct expression for the wavelength? Fine. So, this is the X and the first harmonic is taking place here. So, the general formula will be NV divided by 4L. And this is the first formula. Or, we would be not, we, we need not to use this anyways. So, you see, if this is the... Uh, the first harmonic I can always say that this thing is like lambda by 4 isn't it like this much so x is equal to lambda by 4 and from here I can say that lambda is equal to 4x yes this is how we do it and yes the first option is correct so we can say that wavelength can be expressed in the terms of x like 4x now what is happening in the case of this like y so this is the next harmonic so this is the third harmonic so how it will be looking like it will be looking like this like this so how many harmonics are now here so this is third harmonic this is lambda by 4 lambda by 4 lambda by 4 so in this case we can say y is equal to 3 times lambda by 4 and from here it is evident that we can say that lambda is equal to 4 y by 3 is it given here and yes 1 and 3 are absolutely correct and lambda is equal to 4y is not right relation. So this will be wrong. 1 and 3 is right. So B will be the correct answer. So my dear student, this is how we do it. We are not talking about the frequency. So we need not to bring in this formula in this case. If they were talking about the frequency, we could have brought this thing. But here, they're only concerned with the wavelength. So I'm just comparing the length with lambda by 4. I hope you understand what I'm saying. Okay, my dear students, so let us verify our answer from the mark scheme. And yes, the answer in the mark scheme is B, as I have just shown. So my dear students, this is Professor Varun. I have been uploading so many questions for IB previous question papers uh, in uh, on my YouTube channel. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel. All the best.